Descent brilliance, uh, and I'll make sure to record it in Og because I recorded something in in WAV format before, and it sounded like total shit. And it was also oh, nearly four hundred megabytes. It's me explaining how to tell jokes to Lost. That woman does not understand comedy, <laughs> unless it's about horse running away from her own gay thoughts. <laughs> I was really oh, disappointed God. in it for that comic. I was so disappointed in it because that's barely a joke. I will not say anything because I was in the call and got it to record it. <sighs> Christ, that right, one's that... kind of my fault. Oh yeah, well, actually, I'm gonna just quickly open this letter I got from Refuge because I got drunk last year and watched Patrick Stewart um, promoting charities and. I got I got accosted by a chugger outside of Sainsbury's. Did you punch him in the face? I wanted to. He wouldn't let me into Sainsbury's. That's your British stamina. Uh, you should have just um, told them that you had to go because you'd pooed yourself. And generally, <laughs> the only way for them to confirm that isn't true is highly invasive. What? Look, okay. My my major strategy in life has been if I'm in a situation and I don't know how to deal with it, I just say I have pooed myself because they can't say anything. Because if I have pooed myself, they're being completely irri- like they're not respecting my desire to 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 to, to s- no longer have poo in your pants. Yeah, <laughs> I would. They're they're, they're being. You do like, realize this is all being recorded, Dev. Just uh, confirm. Uh, this is this is basically a life pro tip. And you do realise that I am at the moment getting getting a lot of flack for just ran, uploading random shit, literally at this point, to my channel. And you're telling me this while I'm recording. Yeah, you should upload and say, pro tip from Scribbler, if you get in trouble, either poo yourself or just say you've pooed yourself. Incidentally, this is a, this is a life lesson I've learned from my rats as well. If, if you get into trouble <laughs> and you just defecate furiously, I can guarantee you most trouble will leave you alone at least for a bit. If you... <laughs> If you're being attacked by a dog, if you're being threatened by um, being disciplined at work, uh, if you do, if you've had a bad tax return, bad tax return, if you're on the bus and you don't have the right change, just poo yourself, right? (laughs) Yeah, let one go. Oh dear, oh dear. If you're late for work, just say I had to go home because I pooed myself, and they can't say to you, "Well, you should have come in." With, with your drawers all full of poo, because, frankly, that is a poor working environment. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. Well, this is off to a good start already. I, I can tell we're we're in the right mindset for this story. I'm so so I'm so sorry. Getting there. Oh, we yeah. are. Yeah. Yeah. I find that... Je- I, I, I'm so sorry, Elliot. I'm, I'm blaming myself for this for being late and having my computer... My computer well, it's, at least we're not talking about clop in your absence. That's usually the way these uh, go. Food, clop, and now defecation. Food clock defecation. Sometimes, if you've got a really bad fic, it'll be all three at once. Make it so, number two. This <laughs> 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 is this review is magical already. Hello and welcome to the heroic review. I lost my train of thought. Let me. Tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> it's so Where funny. Was that show review? Oh boy! Cutest scenes ever. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, I want you to squeeze her and dig a hole. Sorry, Suki. <laughs> Hang on, the squeaking has really bothered her. I'm going to let her out the room. Now, <laughs> Chica, go on. Your ears can't take it. I'm sorry, sweetheart. Okay. Okay, she's not a fan dog. She can't take squeeing. <laughs> of oh, course. dear. But yes, I really, really liked that. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no>. What now? <laughs> well, yeah. mod, moderate us. Okay then. Speaking. Yes. Oh my gosh. Speaking of Grandpa Gr- <laughs> What's his name? Again? Grandpa Gruff. What's Grandpa Gruff? Holy shit! No. Oh Who's my texting god. Me? <laughs> the number of... you are dialing is not in service. <laughs> <laughs>
Fucking hell, Lost, what are you doing texting me now? <laughs> <laughs> Get in the heroic review, you whore. <laughs> <laughs> Please message her that. Oh, this is Love so Anna. heroic brain fart later. I have a point. <laughs> I'm literally, I, don't, I just rose my hand in the air like I was back in school. <laughs> I have a point. <laughs> um, speaking of, oh my god, it works so well in audio. Yeah, it's just it's great to see Gummy mostly because he just contrasts so well with Pinkie Pie. And he had a tongue, although today he it, he was quite quick with that tongue. That sounded so wrong. <laughs> Oh, buddy, fuck you, Internet. <laughs> Everything I say sounds bad. He was quite talented having no gums and using his tongue to lick his face. That sounds even worse. <laughs> that sounds really <laughs> worse. <laughs> oh, God. Just leave it as that, the more disturbing one. Oh, this is going to be the worst episode ever. Should we just rename this the perverted review? <laughs> we'll just leave D Gummy's tongue alone. He was Oh shut up. The, the the movement of him removing cake off, the cake stuff off his face was was smooth. No, no it's nothing worse. This character's called the cakes. <laughs> we're just no. we're, we're not going to be able to refer to this specifically. No, we're not. The moment where Gummy licks his own face. Okay. There we go. Yes. That's it. There we go. <laughs> Just beep out like half of that conversation. <laughs> just have like you know when you have those like ee, ee, ee. <laughs> just have that for like whenever we're talking. This is not <laughs> a rap music video. We are not going to do that. We, we are not Vanamelon. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if any of this is gonna make it into the review, but I am demanding that I get this file yeah. if it doesn't get in. Well, you yeah. you are recording it. You have plenty of material to work with. <laughs> that was terrifying. Mm, and they were very. <laughs> Anna, <laughs> you just typed in the chat. Anna, the heroic review starring Scribbler's ear fetish. <laughs> <laughs> and now that you've said this, it out loud, we thing. have it recorded. <laughs> this cannot be a I thing. I was going to say it out loud. <laughs> That's why I, I, I swear it popped up in the it like flashed up in the middle of the screen. Like what the hell? Ethan, I am so sorry you have to edit this. <laughs> I'm not sorry at all. <laughs> it's fine. I love pony ears. I'm not afraid to admit it. <laughs> no, they are pretty cool to be honest. But And so flabby. <laughs> oh. What are we talking He's about again? So flabby. Yeah, I've yeah, I think on. we've lost the plot here, but we've always we did we start knowing where the plot was gonna be apart from the episode, we've looked at our own plot. <laughs> No, pr pretty much Turn around, not. can't find it, no plot. Pretty much not, no. <laughs> so let's oh, see. I know what we can talk about! Oh, oh, um... Yes, Anna? And it says, hey, fuckface, wanna go eat something? <laughs> Gonna have to bleep that. <laughs> no, we're very inconsistent when it comes to editing out curse words anyway. That's because none of you realize what half the curse words in Britain are. I think fuckface might pass muster though. I was going to, I was going to say what I understand is the worst word, uh, in Britain. So, what is the worst word in Britain? Uh, Cooper. Excuse me. Apparently, it's a really bad curse word. I don't know about that. My next door neighbor is called Mallory Cooper. Poor lady. Ooh. No, no, I remember because that was the reason why you couldn't call Sly Cooper Sly Cooper. In Europe, it had to be changed to Sly Raccoon, because Cooper is a curse word over there. Might be no. in mainland Europe, it's not Britain. Well, okay, we have then. so many people with a surname Cooper, that would be really awkward. Just to be safe, let's edit out this entire conversation. The worst curse word in England, according to William Shakespeare, was, You Prince of Wales. <laughs> <laughs> Just say. Uh, I'm American, even I find that funny. <laughs> uh <laughs> Rainbow Dash was the one doing the rejecting. Mm. Especially, yeah, at the end. It sort of bears out in the comic dub you did recently. Hey! Shout out! <laughs> Regardless of the... <coughs> Hello, dog. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> whoop, whoop! <laughs> <laughs> so many bloopers in this episode. Sergey! <laughs> She's on the other side of the house and you can still hear her! Uh.
She's like, feed me now. She's been fed. She's a greedy bum. <laughs> okay. Go to bed. Woof, never. Pinkie Pie <laughs> saying, I know what these scones need. She went, what? Friendship? No, baking powder. <laughs> Perfect. It's like, oh my god! Because friendship might be magic, but friendship isn't baking. <laughs> friendship don't taste good. Which means food isn't magic. By association. Which means food isn't friendship. Oh! Well, this is where I've been going wrong in my life! <laughs> well, then how do they become friends if food isn't friendship? I don't know, they offer each other dead babies or something. <laughs> Ugh. That took a dark turn. <laughs> I don't know, I was... I panicked. <laughs> Actually, no, it wasn't Natasha Levenger. It was Amy Keating Rogers. Oh, Ooh. well, don't I look the fool. And she definitely has written before. Wait, okay, what we need to do, hold on. Amy Keating Rogers. Every we'll time. Just go back and edit that in. <laughs> every time. Ethan, Gubasa don't you says... dare. You leave this in. You leave in that he got the name wrong. <laughs> My reputation is ruined. I just think that. No, wait, no, Kumbasa, you just say Amy Keating Rogers right now. I just think it'd be hilarious. We just had like, like Amy Keating Rogers. I'm just like, fucking. Okay, hang on. I can do this. <clears throat> Amy Keating Rogers. Is this the point yeah. where I should say that it wasn't just her, it was also Charlotte Fullerton? That too, yes. <laughs> Fuck. Actually, I might be right, wrong on that one, but it was just too good a line to leave. Oh, God, I'm going to get so much hate mail. I'm accusing Rogers of the best. Un unsubscribe. A-K-R. Hang on. No, they're going to unsubscribe from my channel. Come back. <laughs> Come back. <laughs> I, think <laughs> I think we've just completely gone off the rails now. <laughs> I think we just go for final thoughts now. Okay, then. You need to introduce him. Fuck! Later. Shit! Cock. <laughs> Bollocks! So, I suppose... Who are you, James Mate? Uh, okay. You what, mate? <laughs> <laughs> the best MLP episode in the world. So, final thoughts, Anna? Fuck. Um... <laughs> I'm sorry to put you on the spot <laughs> like this. No, she had no warning whatsoever. Um, I mean, we never do final thoughts at the end. I just, I just blanked. I had something and I was like, "Don't ask me deep. first." Okay, then. Oscar Blood. I thought it was going to be the intro in the way we were introduced. <laughs> so I was okay, like, <laughs> Let, Let's try this again. Final thoughts, Anna. Sometimes I love this job. We will be even be in it next time. Females for the win. I do hope that that is the case. There was more <laughs> estrogen in this episode than any other heroic, heroic career ever. <laughs> British yeah. estrogen? Yes, the Brits are coming. The Brits are coming. Dun, dun, and this was probably one of our most tangent-filled episode in weeks. This is why we're not allowed on it very often, because we just derail things all over the shop. Really, I just thought it was because you couldn't get here. <laughs> no, I've been banned. Steady Rich banned me. And apparently there's going to be an episode called Party Pooped. Oh god, it's patty cakes all over again. <laughs> wait, wait, even better. Guess what the next episode is called after Slice of Life. Oh, what do I ask? <laughs> Princess Spike. Why? What's gonna happen is it's gonna be the plot of Princess Trixie Sparkle, apart from, um... <laughs> it's gonna be Spike and Twilight body switched. <laughs> If it turns out to actually be that, I'm coming after you. <laughs> after me? <laughs> well, I can't get to Magpie. She's in the wrong oh country. Oh, my God. No, yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, I hear this knock at my door and just like, what have you done? Like the pitchfork just comes shoving through it. Anna? <laughs> Anna, come out to play. Oh, crap. You pe oh, no, you know where I live as well. You have my address. <laughs> I forgot that. <laughs> Please don't fire me, Scribble <laughs> Senpai. <laughs> Senpai noticed me. <laughs> Senpai ignores you forever. I, I imagine if they hadn't asked you to butt munch, it would be bad manners, yes. Well, I mean, that depends on the circumstance. <laughs> One must politely ask before butt munching. Right, you can't just assume that they want a friendly butt munch. Mm. Right, so we'd best not waste time because people gotta go places. Right, 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 right. Right, so if you're, gonna, if you're in here, you've got to be quiet, okay? Good girl. Right. Oh, Suki, no! Oh my god! She farted, didn't she? <laughs> You've been here 
for like 30 seconds and you've smelled the place out. Don't look at me like that. You did. They think you're a fart factory because the only thing you do when I talk to them is fart. Don't look so cute. Oh my, <laughs> oh my god. Oh. It's like if somebody left a corpse out in the daylight for ages and ages and ages and then covered it in vinegar and set it on fire. <laughs> right, you down. Down. Lay down. Down. No, don't lick me. Down. Down. No, no hugs. All right. I love you too. Stop buzzing! Oh. It's a good thing you're recording this. To be honest, I thought we were starting really quickly. That's why I started recording, not because I wanted to record yet again my farting dog. Well, <laughs> bonus. Do the ponies rule the world or not? No. no. Twilight's getting ready to teach. Yeah. Twilight's getting ready to tweet. <laughs> She's getting ready to tweet? <laughs> She's got to eat her Wheaties. <clears throat> okay, I got this. <clears throat> Hashtag alicorn problems. <laughs> <laughs> so, who wants to talk about Flurry Heart? Okay, everybody, you're taking that bullet for us. If we have to. We have to acknowledge the alicorn in the room. Tabitha Sinch main voices every baby on the show. Tara Strong voiced the cake twins, I think. This is going to require me to go on the wiki. This is live research, folks. Just to clarify, if anyone is interested, Tabitha St. Germain played Pound Cake and Andrea Libman played Pumpkin Cake. What? Just to round that one off. So the Cake Twins were played by two different actresses. What? My mind is blown!